Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Shout out Richie and Tega. Dead hats are lit. Make sure to go check out his channel. He has great content and has a great personality. I will link his channel down in the description box. So today's video is going to be about how to distress a pair of jean shorts to make them a little bit more raw, a little bit more edgy for the summertime. Alright guys, so the jean shorts I'm going to be using for this video is this pair of Calvin Klein jean shorts I have right here. They have an acid wash and as you can see, they just have a really clean look. No rips or distressing in them at all. And I want them to look a little bit more raw and a little bit more edgy. So I'm going to show you guys how you can do that. So the tools you'll need for this distressing process is something to put inside the uh, jean short, something like a thick book, that's what I used, or just something hard so when you're cutting the shorts you don't cut through to the back side. You'll also need a pair of scissors, uh, a razor blade, a marking utensil if you decide to use one. I didn't use a marking utensil, I just went ahead and cut the jeans without uh, making any marks on them. And then you'll also need a pair of tweezers. To start this distressing process off, I went ahead and grabbed my scissors and cut the bottom of the jean shorts off just because these jean shorts specifically, the bottoms were folded up and I didn't really like that look and I wanted the bottoms to have that raw edged look to them. I found it easiest when cutting the bottoms of the jean shorts off to make a cut in the jean shorts and then go ahead and stick your scissors inside the cut you made and then cut along that instead of just trying to cut the whole bottom off as a whole. After you cut the bottom of the jean shorts off, go ahead and give the shorts a tug. And then as you can see, there's little white threads hanging out. Go ahead and pull those threads out for it will give you that raw edge distressed look. So after you're done pulling the white threads on the bottom of the jean short and you have your desired look there, go ahead and grab the book or whatever you're going to use to insert inside the leg and then go ahead and insert that inside your uh, jean short leg. So once you have your book inserted in the leg, you can go ahead and grab your razor and we can start making our cuts to the jean shorts. So a little tip when making your cuts in the jean shorts, if you want your distressing shape to look more like a rectangle or some sort of shape, then go ahead and make all your lines the same length. But if you just want it to look very disorderly and displaced, then go ahead and make your cuts all different lengths. So as you can see here, the cuts I'm making are all different lengths because I don't want it to look like a perfect rectangle. And then on the top half of the jean short, I made um, the cuts very similar in length so it looks more just like a square. Then here on the other leg, as you can see, I'm making my cuts toward the bottom because that is the section that I want to distress on the other leg. And then the cuts on the upper half of the jean short, as you can see, I'm making them all different lengths because I don't want it to look like a square or a rectangle. Put you, put you 
So once you have all your desired cuts placed in whichever places you want to on the jean shorts, you're ready to go ahead and grab your tweezers and start pulling threads. Here I have a sample piece of denim just to show you guys um, how to pull the threads out. You have the white threads which run horizontally and then the blue threads which run vertically. We're going to be pulling the blue threads out to reveal the white threads. Pulling threads out is very tedious and could get somewhat boring. What I like to do to make it more enjoyable is put on my favorite music and jam out to that while I'm pulling the threads out. For me, this just helps speed up the process and make it more enjoyable than it is. So once you're done pulling all your threads out, what I'd like to do is go back in and the spots where I made the cut marks, I like to go ahead and pull out some of the horizontal uh, white threads just to reveal more of the blue threads. Therefore my cut line isn't very straight and it has more of a raw look. So once you're done pulling all the threads out of the jean shorts, they're going to look something like this and they look pretty good right now, but the next step of this process, what you're going to do is throw them in the washer for one cycle and then put them in the dryer for one cycle. And this is really where the magic happens because when you wash the distressed denim, it really makes everything flare up and pop and just have an awesome, unique distressed look. Alright guys, as you can see, here's the shorts out of the dryer and you can just see how washing and drying them makes them look 10 times better. As you can see, all the fabric around where you made your cuts and distress marks, um, it's very flared up looking and it just makes the jean shorts have an all around more unique and awesome look in my opinion. All right guys, so there you have it. That's how you distress the jean shorts. Let's go ahead and see what these look like on body. Make sure if you're new here to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also go ahead and smack that like button. Leave me a comment down below on what you thought about the video. And guys, remember, don't forget to go check out my boy Richard's channel. I'll leave that down in the description box. And as always, guys, I will see you on the next one. I call it housework. Cause it's like work. What you, what you gonna do?